Hello and welcome to IT Convergence User Productivity Kit tutorial series. This is a demonstration of how to edit action properties using the Oracle UPK developer. The lower section of the Frame Properties tool pane contains settings that describe the action performed in the frame. The action type setting indicates the type of action taken for the current frame. There are three basic action types, keyboard, string input, and mouse. The object type setting refers to the type of object on which you perform the action. The object name setting refers to the name of the object on which you perform the action. This name is entered in the appropriate place in the bubble template to tell the user which icon or menu item to click or which option to select. The developer automatically enters information for its settings and determines the appropriate bubble text. The Frame Properties tool pane, however, allows you to change those settings if necessary. To change the Action Type setting for the current frame, click the Action Type list and select the desired action type. To change the Object Type setting for the current frame, click the Object Type list and select the desired object type. To change the Object Name setting for the current frame, click the Object Name field and edit the object name as desired. The action indicates where the action takes place in a frame and is designated by a red rectangle overlaying the frame's screenshot. You may find that you need to modify the action area, have more than one action to accommodate an action on a particular frame or even delete an action area. To create a new action area for the current frame, Click the Modify Action Areas icon and choose the Create New Action command. To move the action area, point to any area within the action area. The mouse pointer changes into a four-headed arrow. Hold the left mouse button and drag the action area to any location and release the mouse button. To resize the action area, point to a selection handle on the action area Drag the selection handle in the desired direction and release the mouse button. To delete an action area from the current frame, first click the action area you want to delete. Click the Modify Action Areas and choose the Delete Action Area command. Click Yes to confirm the deletion. When playing a topic in trade mode, a rectangle appears around the area in which you must click or type to move to the next frame. To disable this rectangle around the action area from appearing, click the action area on off icon. This concludes our tutorial on how to edit action properties using the Oracle UPK developer. On the behalf of IT Convergence, I'd like to thank you for your time and invite you to join IT Convergence YouTube channel where you can learn more about user productivity kit features and functions. Thank you.